Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen. I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach who has lost and maintained a 140 pound weight loss and it is Saturday, so it's grocery haul day. I shopped at two stores this week. I found some new food finds and some really, really, really good deals. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because I do a grocery haul every Saturday and I actually upload five videos every single week. Check out the description box down below where you will find nutrition coaching. Highly, highly recommend those personalized macros and calories. That is what I follow to lose and maintain my 140 pound weight loss, as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for questions, accountability, or to talk with me directly. Links, discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. It's free, it's supportive, we would love to have you. It's all down in that description box. So let's jump into this week's grocery haul. So the first part of my grocery haul is actually from Trader Joe's. While little Miss Lola went to chemo, I made a run over to Trader Joe's, picked up some of our staples and some new things that were recently released. So let me show you part one of my grocery haul from Trader Joe's. As always, I picked up some flowers. They sat in the car, so they definitely need to get put into some water, but I love their flowers. They last forever, and I thought these were perfect for summer. These are new, these are the S'mores Cluster. So mini marshmallows and graham crackers covered in milk chocolate. I did have one of these, they are so good. You get three of them for 180 calories. So just kind of a nice little sweet treat for summer. And then I also tried these, I had one of these as well. These are the milk chocolate covered honeycomb candy. I can't remember what these are called if you go to a chocolate store, but I love them. They have the really crispy center. Three of them, 150 calories, so 50 calories a piece. So just a couple of fun little sweet treats. And then I got a refill of my soft and juicy mango. I love the Trader Joe's soft and juicy mango. I count this to zero points because it has the exact same macros as fresh mango, and I don't eat the whole packet. I eat the same amount as I would eat of a fresh mango, so I do not track this. Got a lot of dog treats. That's one of the main reasons that I went there, and I got these rawhide peanut butter flavored retrievers. My dogs really, really like these the last time I got them and they have nice clean ingredients and then I also got the organic chicken and brown rice sticks these are new these little surfs up dog treats and little miss Pal mr. Palmer's on the front so I thought that was so cute they're pork sweet potato and coconut and they're little surfer shapes I thought the, thought those were really fun for summer and then I've never bought these for my dogs but the lady that checked me out at the register said her dog loves these basically all it is is dried Himalayan cheese and they make dog bones out of this so she just said her dog loved it they were a really good price at Trader Joe's and then I grabbed a refill of organic rolled oats because Costco did not have rolled oats at least the Costco that I went to and I'm almost out and I've been eating a lot of oats so I grabbed those I always buy my rolled oats organic because they're sprayed with the same pesticides that's in Roundup. So that is one thing I'm really particular about. I got these because they sound amazing. These are the cinnamon graham crackers. Dogs are eating their chicken and rice if you hear clinging collars. So, but I thought that these would be a nice, just a kind of sweet treat. You can make s'mores out of these, super fun for summer. And then I always buy the cheese tray because it's only $5.99, which is about half the price of cheese trays at other stores. And this one has Colby Jack, Swiss, mild cheddar, and pepper jack. Lots of frozen stuff for Troy. He loves the fettuccine Alfredo. I got a package of the cauliflower gnocchi. And then he also loves the chicken fried rice. So I picked him up two packages. This is just a really easy, quick dinner. Actually, all of these are really quick dinners or sides. And then we're having VLTs this week. You'll see my meal plan at the end of the video. And Troy asked for big fat cut bacon. So I got this really thick cut bacon. $6.99, which is a lot, but I'm going to do turkey bacon on my sandwiches and he can eat all of this. But this is definitely some stout thick bacon. I also got cheese, no surprise. These are my favorite cheeses. The light shredded mozzarella and the Trader Joe's three cheese blend. I also have not had a Bear Bell in a long time. Last time I had them, they kind of hurt my stomach, so I only bought one, but I've heard that this creamy crisp one is really good. So I picked up one, I'm going to try it again. It sounds amazing, and like I said, I've seen it all over TikTok and people just rave about it. I also got some flour because it was only $2.99, which it's over $5 at my local Kroger store, and this is unbleached flour. And then this is another thing I really wanted, and this is the garden vegetable hash. So it's cauliflower, zucchini, bell peppers, fire roasted corn, celery, and yellow onion. I've been making my little egg white omelets that I shared in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. And I wanted some veggies that I could add to the omelet. And this is already cut up, 
ready to go. This is perfect for stir fry soups, amazing. And then I got a big pack of sliced cremini mushrooms for a recipe. So that is everything for the week from Trader Joe's. Let's jump into the rest of the grocery haul. And here's the rest of my grocery haul for the week from my local fry store, which is a Kroger store. They're having some really great deals right now. What you don't see is a case of water and two 24 packs of Diet Coke. All Coke products, 24 packs are $10.99. So really good deal. Let me show you what else I picked up. A couple of non-food things. I needed a restock of my Lysol brand new day brand new day cleaner. Love the smell of this. It's really, really yummy. It kind of smells tropical like summer. And then I got a restock of our paper plates. One of the really good deals right now are Yasso bars. They're on a digital coupon for $3.99 a box, which is an amazing deal up to five boxes. So I bought four. I did a coffee chocolate chip for myself and then I got mint chocolate chip, chocolate chip cookie dough. And then this one sounds really good. Black raspberry chip. So that actually makes it about the same price as Costco. And last week when I shopped at Costco, they didn't have them. So I was really happy to see those on coupon. I also grabbed some sweet treats for the week. I have vanilla iced blueberry bread. Troy really likes this. And then I picked him up some sugar cookies. And then I got these little mini scones. I love these. They're about 100 calories a piece. They're perfect to pair with some protein for breakfast. So I picked those up as well. These were $1.30, $2.47, and $2.84. Some instant white rice. This is for Lola for the week. I'm going to cook her up some ground turkey and some rice. She definitely hasn't been feeling the best since her treatment on Tuesday, so I want to make sure that she has something that she'll eat this week. And then I grabbed two of these for Troy or for me. These are little Cracker Barrel Bites, and it's basically two kinds of cheese and some crackers. And these were on clearance for 72 cents. So I picked up two of them. I thought they would be quick, easy, on-the-go snacks. And then I needed canned chicken for a recipe. And one can was $5 or three cans was eight. So I went ahead and just got three cans. I should have just bought the big pack at Costco last week. It would have been a better deal, but I need chicken for my lunch meal prep. I also grabbed some yogurts. So these were $1.29. So I picked up a strawberry cheesecake and a toasted vanilla. And then these were $1.50 each. And these are the two good and I love the lemon. It's my favorite, favorite for yogurt bowls. So I picked up four yogurts for the week. I grabbed Troy a summer sausage. He requested this for his meat, cheese, and crab. Speaking of crackers, this is another really good deal going on right now. The family size boxes of both Triscuits and Wheat Thins are $4.99 a box, but if you buy three, they're $3.99 a box. So I went ahead and bought three. So I did get original Triscuits for Troy. I got reduced fat Wheat Thins for me and then regular Wheat Thins for Troy. So that's a really good deal. $3.99 for the big, huge box when you buy three. So needed some rice vinegar for a recipe. I was actually out of this the last time I needed it, so I picked it up this time around. I also got some Daisy sour cream. We are going to have a taco night, so I wanted to make sure that we had sour cream. And then this was on sale for $2.47. It was on clearance. I think they're no longer going to be carrying this, but this is from Nature's Path Organic, and it's a variety of instant oatmeal. Apple cinnamon, multigrain raisin, flax plus, and maple nut. And I thought this would be really good to pair with some protein for breakfast. And you can also use these in overnight oats as long as you add a liquid to it. And they already have the flavors in them. And I thought that was a killer deal, $2.47. And then also the Oscar Mayer lunch meat is on digital coupon for $3.99 a piece. Also an amazing deal. So I picked up one pack of uncured ham and one pack of roast beef. These are for Troy for sandwiches and breakfast sandwiches. And then I did grab bacon at Trader Joe's, but again, a really good digital coupon, $6.99 for one and a half pounds. The one I picked up at Trader Joe's was $6.99 or $6.49 and wasn't even a full pound. So that's a really good deal. And this again is that nice thick bacon for BLTs this week. I also grabbed a couple gallons of 1% milk for Troy. And then for produce, I got romaine lettuce leaves for my lunch meal prep and also for tacos. I needed tarragon for meal prep to be fully transparent. I've never bought tarragon. I don't even know what it tastes like, but it's in my lunch meal prep. So I got the fresh stuff. We're going to try it out. Lots of tomatoes, again, for a couple of dinner recipes, tacos, as well as one other recipe this week. The Simple Truth brand of organic blueberries were $3.88 on digital coupon. Apparently, that was last week's coupon, but the sign was still out, so she honored it. So instead of $9, it was $3.88 for this big pack of organic 
blueberries, so that was a really great deal. And then I picked up one huge zucchini for a recipe. So that is everything that I picked up grocery-wise for the week. Let's jump into what's on my menu for dinners and what you'll see in Monday's meal prep. So here is what is on my menu for the week. So I'm going to be making Copycat Panda Express Mushroom Chicken. I'm actually really excited to duplicate this recipe. You will see it in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. We are having a taco night and we are doing BLTs this week. And then I'm really excited for Monday's meal prep. I'm making banana protein pancakes. I'm going to make a cranberry walnut chicken salad for lunch. Also so excited for that. And then I'm doing a no-bake dessert because it's 101 here all week. And I'm going to do a no-bake peanut butter oatmeal bar and these also have protein so stay tuned for all three recipes in Monday's meal prep. Thank you for joining me for this week's grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything I picked up from both Trader Joe's and my local fry store which again is a Kroger store. Some good deals, some new food finds. It was a good grocery shopping week. If you enjoyed the video give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, turn your bell on because again I upload a grocery haul every Saturday in five videos every single week. Check out that description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things. And again, my Facebook group, we'd love to have you. Happy Saturday. Have an amazing, amazing weekend, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye, friends.